The Fox 13 Sports Minute, sponsored by your Western Washington Honda dealers. And today marks the start of a new era for the Seahawks, one without Pete Carroll leading the charge. 14 years in the NFL is a long time, and for some 12s, Coach Carroll is all they've known when it comes to the Hawks. So no surprise to hear the shock as fans learned of this news. And Seahawks superfan Big Low joining us live following this huge announcement. Big Low, it is great to see you, my man. Good to be seen, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So, you know, the Hawks, yeah, we know very well the success that they had under Pete Carroll. 137 wins in total, a couple NFC championships, the only Super Bowl title in Seahawks history. How do you feel about the team's decision to part ways with the head coach? Well, at first, it was a, a definite cry moment, but uh, bittersweet. Um, after processing everything and seeing the options that we have, um, I'm, I'm, I'm doing a lot better. It's, it's definitely mind-blowing because I think a lot of us fans thought there was going to be another year, possibly two. And so just... Uh, it, it's it's hard to swallow. It's definitely hard to swallow. Yeah, for, I mean, for those of us super hardcore fans, he's the guy that got us to the mountaintop, you know, and I think that's that's part of it. Uh, in your estimation, what legacy does Pete Carroll leave behind for you and for Seahawk Nation? Oh, man, he, he leaves behind huge shoes to fill. It's going to be a tough, tough thing for us to fill those shoes because that fire, that energy, the sidelines, the locker room, all the positivity out of that man. He's just been such a fun coach to watch, such a fun coach to have and a blessing to have as a coach because he got us to the promised land for our first uh, our Super Bowl victory. So it's... Um, it's going to be interesting to see what comes next. Yeah, I mean, just effervescent to the very end. I mean, even yesterday, he was just talking about how jacked he was about starting whatever this new chapter is going to be. Do you have a favorite Pete Carroll memory over the last 14 years? <laughs> There's so many of them. Um, my, my big memory is the fact that every time they go by me at the airport when they leave for trips, is he waves at me from that front seat of the first bus every time. He's always make sure to point at me and give me a wave, and, and that's genuine. After the games, well, the home games, I would wait for the players to come pulling out out of the secure lot, and he's just always stopped and always said hi and, and greeted me with friendship. I mean, Pete was more of a coach. He's, he's become a friend, and it's just uh, it's an honor that we've had this man for so long, and... Uh, it's 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 going to be tough for a while, but as soon as we get that new hire, <laughs> we'll see what happens. Yeah, and I, I think folks need to realize exactly what you're talking about because when you when I say super fan, that is legit. I mean, you are full time in, and when you say the Thank team you. bus is leaving, you are there every single time. <laughs> when we had the Blue Friday parties back in the day on the Super Bowl oh, run, man. you were there every day. Hey, we haven't day won a Super Bowl since those Blue Friday one. parties. I, wasn't my decision, man. That's that's a, above my pay grade. Okay, so now, I, and this is the Toyota question of the day. We're looking for a new head coach. Who do you think would be the best fit? If we don't get Dan Quinn, um, I'd love to see somebody like Eric Bieniemy. He's been with the Chiefs for quite a while, and he's just, he's got that same kind of fire, and he's just, he's, he, he's a guy that'll hold the players accountable, and that's, that's what we need. We need a coach that's going to hold the players accountable and do well as well and keep that fire on the sidelines and keep that fire in the locker room, keep those guys in check to where <laughs> we have definite success but it's going to be tough shoes to fill that's for sure no question about it seattle's biggest sports fan big low thank you so much great to talk with you pal love you guys love you too brother go hawks thank you right. go hawks go hawks